All right, man, no like, no wild intro, no wild intro. This is some serious shit. I'll tell you this right now. I'm tired of this fucking bullshit, man. Breonna Taylor needs fucking justice, and she is, is not, not only is she not getting it, but her fucking whole state just keeps shitting on her death. Like, yeah, cool. Her family got $12 million. Man, that's not justice, right? That's, this is what white people do. White people just throw money at black people to make problems go away. So, Lacey, input. So, I was getting ready to go to bed. I was checking Twitter. And I saw this tweet from a few hours ago. And it got me hot as fuck. And I was, at first I was like, wait, did I miss something? Because I didn't get any breaking news alerts. And then the more I investigated, the more I found out. Basically, as of right now, very early on Tuesday, September 22nd, um, all of Louisville Metro Police Department has been all told that they are all hands on deck tomorrow, federal buildings are all being boarded up, regular businesses are all being boarded up, the city of Louisville has announced a state of emergency, Everything is in anticipation for dickbag Daniel Cameron, the Attorney General of Kentucky, to announce that there will be no charges brought for any of the police officers involved in Breonna Taylor's murder. Not death, murder. Murder. So, because in America, you can murder a black person and then just throw money at him. Here, take this money. Now it's okay that we murdered your daughter. Now, I know everybody loves to sit there and say, why'd they shoot the police? Why'd they shoot the police? Let's talk about this, since I know everybody loves Yeah, yo, guns. let's get real about it. No, let's, let's talk about it. Everybody loves guns in this country because they I think love guns. that they need to protect their home. So, what do you think is going to happen in the middle of the night? They even shot at the ground. When, it's a warning when shot. Hear, when you hear people at your fucking door and you think someone's breaking in. What are you going to do with that gun? That's exactly what it's That's for. That's what a gun is for! So all the people that sit there and want to criticize this entire fucking situation, I hope that when somebody breaks into your house, you don't use your fucking gun since apparently you're not fucking allowed yeah, to. Yeah, yeah. You're not allowed to use your gun. I hope you fucking die. Yeah, I said it on YouTube. Guess what? Because if someone tries to come into my house, if someone comes into my fucking house, I'm not giving no warning shots. I'm killing your ass. I'm shooting right for your fucking face. You come in my house uninvited, I'm not, yo, the police are lucky they got shot in the leg. Fucking lucky they got shot in the leg. I'm fucking, I'm so hot. Yo, that, yo, that whole city is about to get burnt down. Which led to Ernie and I having the conversation about the protests, because apparently kneeling isn't peaceful enough. Everybody's got an opinion about that. Apparently just showing up into the streets having literal silent protests, nope, that's not good enough either. People only care when it's about materials. Yep. Like, apparently lives don't matter. It's only about materials nah. and shit burning. So we had this conversation. We're like, okay, obviously the dickbags that are coming into these cities that are just trying to cause destruction, that's a completely different story. So don't loop them in with protesters. However, people only are paying attention when shit's actually happening, when shit's burning to the ground. I just get tired of it. I just get tired of it. I get totally tired of it. It's fucking sick and it's disgusting. Yo, here's $12 million. Here you go. Like... Yo, her boyfriend shot in the ground. It's a warning shot. It's a fucking warning shot. It was a no-knock warrant. The police didn't announce themselves. What the fuck else are you supposed to do? This is why we have guns, right? Woo! America! Yeah, guns! Woo! What the fuck else are you supposed to do? I, I need answers. Yo, if you give me answers, I just also want to know, like, know. why are you going to try to offer the dude that they were looking for a fucking plea deal to name her as part of this whole operation? How shady does that fucking look? It's just bad. And then, clearly, when he's not willing to take the damn deal, I mean, come on here. They were trying anything and everything to make it look like she was a part of this situation. It's because just... she dated the dude, from everything that I've heard, it was years ago. Not even like it was months. You know what and I'm I don't really, even think it was dated. I think it was like casually saw. You know what I'm really disgusted about? I'm disgusted more so of this uh, conception of America where like, let's just throw money at black people. I think it's disgusting. It's not even at throwing money at black people. It's just throwing money at a problem and making it shut up. Well, so people, right, that's what happens but, in all high profile like sexual assault cases. 
Jeffrey Epstein's a perfect example in regards to underage. No, we're not going to sit here and say underage girls. We're going to say children. They're children. If you're under the fucking age of 18, you're a child. That's a whole different topic. All right, I feel but like we're getting on. No, yeah, it's, it's the throwing the money focused. at the problem, hoping that it goes away. Uh, yeah, I just feel like it happens a lot more to the black community. like, And it's not fair. It's not fair. I'll be the first one to tell you it's not fair. And look, man, I can't tell you how many subscribers I lost. I got kicked off of YouTube literally for fighting for Black Lives Matter. I'm not stopping. <laughs> Yo, guess what? If you don't like what I got to say, you know where the unsubscribe button is. It's point blank, period. It's a free country, as everybody loves to try to yeah, say. Yeah, free country. Unsubscribe, do all that shit, man. Because I'll tell you this right now. We need justice for Breonna Taylor, and we sure as shit ain't getting it. So, this video was long overdue. Lacey, anything else you want to add? Because I'm fucking disgusted. Yo, the next person that tries to tell me America is the best fucking country in the world can shut the fuck up and suck my dick from the back. America is not even a top five country in the world. America sucks, all right? America is shitty. We are horrible. Horrible health care. We're racist as fuck. Yo, America is fucking horrible. And let me save everybody. If you don't like it, then leave. Yeah, don't like it, leave. I would gladly leave. However, because this country is so fucking stupid, the rest of the world won't let Americans in. Yeah! So. No one's letting Americans go to their country because they're smart and we're stupid. So, first of all, shut the fuck up. Second of all, shut the fuck up. Third of all, shut the fuck up. We want justice for Breonna Taylor. Apparently, we're never going to get it, but we still want it. So, until we get it, we go, yo, we going to march, man. We going to march. Yo, I'm telling you, shit's going to get bad. Louisville's going to be cool. Louisville about to get lit the fuck up like a Christmas tree. Yo, they're already, Lacey was telling me they're already boarding shit up. Yo, I'm telling you right now. You know what? On some real shit, though. Like, so. The cr what I can't even wrap my head around is some of the other cases that have been pretty high profile since George Floyd and then when Breonna Taylor was, yeah. people started talking about it. Like, those off, there have been officers that have been charged within a matter of days. And this has been dragging on for six months. No, six I'm, months. believe me, I know. And dumb fuck Daniel Cameron has had this case on his little desk since May. It's disgusting. It's disgusting. Yo, what, what really has me high is black people can't protest in silence because black people can't take a knee because that's like, against what America. Is the preferred way like, to protest? What are they supposed to do? Like, y'all keep wondering, like, why are they doing all this fucking... For, uh, P.S., uh, 88 to 90 percent of the protests have been peaceful. Yo, we're lucky because people are going out there with the. We are so incredibly lucky. Black people aren't coming for all of us, considering everything that fucking has happened to them. Like, I'm just sick of hearing come that, on. that kneeling at a football game is un-American. Uh, but yeah, people can try to suppress you to vote, and that's clearly fucking. It's okay. Fucking disgusting. America is the fucking. Other than, like, weird countries, yo, this America is fucking disgusting. I'm disappointed to be an American. If you want to say don't like it, then leave. You can suck my dick from the back because you're a part of the problem. It's fucking gross, man. It is not it wrong is to fucking want the gross. place that you live to be better. Yeah, we man. We all want it to be yeah, better. Yeah, and it's not better. And if you don't it's... want it better, and I'm not talking about make America great again. I'm talking oh. about actually better. Yo, also, make America great. Yo, tell me the last time America was great. I just don't understand why he's claiming that he's going to make it great again. Bitch, what have you been doing for the past four years then? Destroying it. Golfing. A lot of golfing and a lot of racism. Grabbing bitches by the pussy, I would assume. All right, guys. We're going to go ahead and get off of here. Thank you for hearing me and Lacey out. Um, also, if you don't support Brianna Taylor and the Black Lives Matter movement, uh, the unsubscribe button is down below. You can suck my dick from the back. My stance has cost me probably about $10,000. <laughs> but I feel like money isn't everything in life. Uh, it's not. You, you, you have to be a good person. And I'm a good person. 
And so I'm gonna stand up for what I think is right. And whatever it costs me, it costs me. So that's where I'm at. Love you guys. Lacey, anything else you wanna say before we get off here? Fuck Daniel Cameron. Fuck Daniel Cameron! That counts for Mafia! Puff Gang! Pew, 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 pew! Skr, skr. Hey, Daniel Cameron, suck our dick from the back. Pussy bitch. Yeah, with your sucker ass bitch, oh.